When she struck all her matches, the whole world suddenly seemed to light up. Stars shot down from the sky. No, no the, whole the whole bundle. The whole world didn't light up. A bouquet of matches. <laughs> to her world, did. She's stupid. The light match. The little match girl felt the warmth and warm and wonderful. As she looked around, the little match girl had an amazing vision. She saw an angel dressed in all white. The angel. She's saying hi. The angel was <laughs> smiling and coming toward her with outstretched arms. What if the angel just said hi and left? And left her completely the same. Didn't even warm her up or anything. Good. Oh, they carried her home and brought her clothes. Her home's where? If she's homeless, then why the hell is she dressed like that? The angel picked up the little match girl in her in her arms and smiled upon the small face. The angel started to walk, carrying the little match girl. Where are we going? asked the girl. I'm taking you to a place where you'll never be cold, the angel replied. Liar. She's dying, basically, <laughs> as they rose slowly into the Does night. Does she not know that winter is part of the season? Yeah, that's a creepy Christmas She won't be cold again. <laughs> Winter is part of the season. <laughs> it is a place always filled with light and warmth. <laughs> she said she will be cold again. What? We will go where there are o- where there is only laughter and smiles, and where you will never be hungry again. That sounds like gay. Laughter and smiles. That sounds gay. Alex, you're laughing and smiling. <laughs> you're gay. No, I'm not. Look, look, she finally changed her clothes. The wait, next wait. one. No, she, she didn't. didn't. No, she, she still didn't. has her clothes on. The she next still has her freaking clothes on. She's dumb. Oh, you guys are insulting this poor little girl. The next morning, those who emerged from their houses saw a bundle of burnt matches lying in the snow. They wondered what had happened. <laughs> the truth is, uh, she lit herself on fire. And that's why the angel <laughs> came and took her away. Wow. There was ash. Everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> she blew away in the wind. <laughs> what they could not know was that the little match girl had gone to a place where she would always be warm and loved and happy. So happy that every single day would seem just like Christmas. That's, that's a scary story. That, that's yeah, that is scary. Really not a good angel, she, she bled on the snow. Yeah, her feet were bleeding out. She wore the same outfit. She used up all of her matches. Nobody helped her in the story except the damn angel. She saw not one person she, helped her. She, she, that's saw, sad. she saw that's gay true. people. She saw gay people sitting around on Christmas. No one tree. helped her out but an angel. That's pretty that's sad. Pretty Isn't Christmas about helping and loving each other and giving and She saw an angel that just said hi and left. No, the angel we scooped her up and carried her to her death. <laughs> she carried her to her death. That's, that's terrifying. She saw the health code violation. She saw that. She saw a health code I know. Violation. She's going to bring that to wherever she's going and make sure it's better there. She saw gay people. Why gay are they gay? What's the moral of the story? I don't know. The moral of the story, don't be homeless. <laughs> <laughs>